Hey everybody, Mike here. Welcome back to the channel. So, what are we doing today? We're talking about these guys. Now, what is this? Well, uh, I call them pacer beads. Some people call them ranger beads. And it's a navigational uh, tool, navigation device, I would say. Now, how does it work? Well, if you're navigating, especially on foot, right, then there are a couple of things you want to uh, deal with. One is your bearing, but uh, the other is the distance that you went from A to B, right? That's where this comes in. If you're walking, how do you know how far you have been walking? Did you walk a mile, two miles, 10 miles? Who knows, right? So that's where these come in. And like I said, I call them pacer beads. Some people call them ranger beads. Funny thing is that rangers call them pacer beads, not ranger beads. Anyway, so what do we got? We got a string and we've got beads on them that can slide, right? Like this, okay? And it's a fairly tight fit, and that's important. Then I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine at the top, and I got four at the bottom, right? And they can also slide. And there's a knot in the middle, so they stay separated. Now, imagine this, you want to record how far you have been walking. Well, for that, you need to know how many steps you take when you walk, for example, 100 meters, right? Now, I'm doing this in meters, you can do this in miles as well. So 100 meters is one tenth of a kilometer and uh, 528 feet is one tenth of a mile, right? So if you're working in miles, you can uh, calculate the number of steps you walk to cover 528 feet. If you're working in kilometers, you look at how many steps to cover 100 meters. Now, uh, in my case, depending on whether I'm carrying a heavy pack or not, it's somewhere around 60. And what I mean by 60 steps is you start by moving your right foot forward, right? And that's half a step. So your left goes uh, forward and your right goes forward again. That's one step, right? So 60 of those for me is 100 meters. Now, when I'm walking, what I'll do is I'll walk 100 meters. And as soon as I cover that, I slide down one of these beads. Okay, so it's 100 meters covered, right? 200 meters, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, right? 900 meters, and the first one after that would be one kilometer. So I take one of these and I move this one up. So I know I now covered one kilometer, right? I move these nine up and I start over again. So that's one kilometer and 100, 200, 300 and so forth and so on, right? And then, you know, I can go up to uh, four kilometers or four miles that way, right? Let's say you're moving a way shorter distance, then you can adjust your measurement for that as well, right? Let's say you're, uh, I don't know, you're trying to find your way back to your camp and it's only a couple of hundred meters. You can do the same thing. Now, do you need one of these uh, pacer bead strings? Uh, you can. Uh, I made this one myself. You can also buy them. Uh, there's one on Amazon I saw. So if you don't want to make one yourself, I'll put a link below and you can get that one. Uh, but it doesn't have to be beads. You can also put, let's say, I don't know, you put uh, four sticks, right, in your pocket, four little sticks and nine rocks, right, or marbles or whatever, as long as you can identify them, right? So the critical thing is here to understand how many steps you take. So if you're not carrying a backpack at all, you might do 100 meters in, I don't know, 50 steps. If you're wearing a heavy backpack, it might be 65. So that's something, it's kind of a one-time deal that you have to do uh, to kind of figure that out. And uh, it will become second nature really quick. But yeah, that's the mystery behind the pacer beads, right? I find them very, very useful. I use them in combination with my compass and I've been using them for years. So yeah, let me know in the comments if you enjoyed the video, if you like this kind of thing. Uh, if you do, please hit that sub button. Uh, I saw that I'm going towards a thousand subs, which is awesome. Uh, I don't create a lot of content and I'm not uh, monetizing or anything like that. But uh, I do enjoy the fact that you guys enjoy it, right? That's why I make them. So yeah, that said, that's it for me. See you guys in the next one. Bye.